Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, all around the globe. I'd like to talk about follow your dreams. It's in um, Exodus 3, verse 11, 12. And Moses said unto God, Who am I that I should go unto Pharaoh, and that I should bring forth the children of Israel out of Egypt? And he said, Certainly, I will be with thee. So have you ever had um, a Holy Spirit inspired dream? A dream of doing something really great for Jesus? A, dreaming, a dream of being so prosperous, for instance, that you can finance an, a nationwide revival? A dream of leading thousands of people to the Lord. At one time or another, you probably have, but perhaps you backed away from it. You thought, oh my, I couldn't do that. Satan kept me from defeated for so long that I had a self, poor self-image. If that's so, I have some good news for you. If you believe in God, even the poor self-image won't keep you from success. Look in the books of um, Exodus and you'll have a man who proved that. His name was Moses. Moses didn't have a very good self-image. He made a terrible mistake early in his career. It was a, a mistake that drove him into the wilderness and kept him there for 40 years, hurting someone else's sheep. He once dreamed of um, being a deliverer of God's people, but then no more. As far as he was concerned, he was finished, a failure, a flop, but God didn't think so. When God um, came to Moses, in the wilderness he didn't ask Moses credentials he didn't mention his shady history he just told him to go see Pharaoh and tell him to let God's people go Moses however was still wrestling with his poor self-image. Who am I that I should go to Pharaoh? He stumbled. You know, what God said in response, he just said, certainly I will be there with thee. You see, it doesn't matter who Moses was. What matter, mattered was that he, the living God was with him. The same thing is true for you and me today. You don't need a history of success behind you to answer God's call. You don't need a string of spiritual credentials. All you need is a presence with the Lord. Think about that. When the devil tells you you're a failure, when he says you'll never be able to do what God has put in your heart to do, Put him in his place. 
tell him, it doesn't matter who you are because the living God is in with me. And then dare to follow your dreams. You know, we all have dreams and hopes and passions and we want to bless others because it feels so good. But you know what? We need to praise the Lord for it because he's leading us in everything we do. He guides us. He gives us the wisdom, the strength, the patience, the peace the mercy and the grace to follow our dreams. Sorry, I guess my oxygen's a little crooked, but that's okay. Um, so I keep following my dreams every day by coming on and sharing God's word with you. And if it can help someone to help lead you to the Lord, praise be to God but also to follow your dreams, everyone. God gives us everything from the beginning to the end and everything in between. And nothing is impossible. So today I'm following my dreams and my hopes and my passions with the Lord's word, but also with on passive because it gives me hopes and dreams to be able to bless others. Yeah, it will take time, but that's okay. There's small things I can do every day. But the positivity that I get from reading the Lord's Word, and it leads me into more things and on passive, and the positivity I receive there, and the knowledge knowledge, 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 and the value. There is so much value in on passive. It's mind blowing what is coming, folks. The world is changing with technology. Things are going to be easier for people like you and me. I'm not a computer person, but I'm sure learning. And learning is caring and sharing, just like we do with the Lord's word, care and share and bring people to the Lord. And now it's an opportunity for everyone around the globe to be caring and sharing about on passive because it is a disruptive company that's coming. And I'm so excited because on Saturday, April 30th at 1.30 Eastern Standard Time, which is 11.30 in Saskatchewan here, because this is where I'm from. It's another big event in Dubai. Again, it's sharing and caring and bringing attention to each and every one of us around the globe for something that has never been done before never seen like this before. It's marketing, branding, everything of a company called on passive before we even launch. And we are 1,300,000 almost uh, founders that our company is branding and sharing. There has never been anything like it. So all I can say to everyone, on passive is a blessing and a gift that keeps giving. We have a platform called Oblast. It's going to be disruptive in the world too. It's reshaping humanity all around the globe. It started in India already. And then there's so much coming in May you need to be up on it, is all I can say. If you're a founder and you haven't checked your back office and you haven't kept up on it, please get updated today. It'll only take a little bit of your time. 
but it'll be well worth it. I know in my heart, the Lord says, stay positive, keep up on everything, because it's going to make changes all around the globe. And you know, I am so honored and proud to be a founder because it's going to change my life, my family's life. It's going to give me the opportunity to leave a legacy for generations. I've never had that. I've never had a chance to leave a legacy. There's so many of us that work nine to five, whatever, multiple jobs, and we still didn't have a legacy. We didn't have a pot to pee in is how I say it. Because everything we worked for went back into our living expenses. I wasn't fortunate enough to have a high paying job, a COE job, to make and be able to share and care with others I do it in the small ways, but I was never able to do it the way my heart wants to do it. And I know in on passive, it's going to change my life to be able to share and care the way I need to, the way my heart shows it with oh bless and with on passives interruption of disrupted products that are coming. I will have over 50 streams of income. I have never had more than one or two or three and that was working hard to get it. And long hours. And it was very tough on my children. So if you're in the same position that I was until I became disabled. I'm asking you to check out and become a founder and let it change your life like it's changing mine. You will be so positive and see the vision that is brought from above. I believe totally in my heart. Mr. Ash Mafar, our CEO, is really listening to God. And God is giving him the visions to share with each and every one of us that join him as a founder and trust and believe the process. So how simple can it be? It's an all done system for you. I choose to share and care because if I can change my life, I'm hoping and praying it'll change yours too, which I know it will. You just have to get in before it's too late. Because once it's gone, it's gone forever. Just remember, this is a lifetime opportunity and I wanna share it to each and every one that's in need of a change in their life. Have bigger dreams, bigger hopes, abundance. That's what the Lord wants us to do. There's enough wealth in the world that it can go around for each and every one of us to leave a legacy and change someone else's life. And I believe through O Bless, O Academy, O Connect, O Net, O Staff, just those products will change many, many lives, will change businesses as customers. They will save money, they will save time. So if this resonates with you today, and you want to change your dreams, your hopes, your passions. On passive is the way. 
but you need to get in as a founder before it closes. I, I just pray that each and every one around the globe can see this and hear it and let it really sink in. And for any of those negative people that are out there saying negative things about On Passive, don't worry about it. Our CEO, Mr. Ash Mafara, and the good Lord will take care of them. Because negativity is negativity, but positivity is positivity. And the Lord wants positivity. I want positivity because I am so excited. So again, on Saturday at 1.30 Eastern Standard Time, we will be broadcasting across YouTube channels at the thetalk.live. You can Google it, you can go on there. It's on multiple channels. We've had three other events in Dubai and they're mind blowing. It's never been done folks never been done like this. It takes marketing and branding and advertising before we even launch. Who's heard of that? Absolutely amazing. I know I could go on and on today because I am so excited. So excited. But I'm looking for visionaries people that are willing to help and bless others, not just think of themselves. Because I know when those apples come in, that's what I will be doing. I'm checking with different organizations here in Regina as we speak and what their needs are and how I may be able to help them one day. But we have to find out what the needs are first. But if I can help one person to change their lives or their family's lives, praise be to God, I'm doing what I need to do. So if each and every one around the world can change one person's life. Whoa, isn't that mind blowing? Can you imagine what the humanity, the poverty, how it would change? It could change so fast. It would make your head swim. Just to think about, we have a million, almost 300,000. And if we change one person's life, that's a big change. And if we keep doing it and doing it and doing it, the world will become a better place. Like our CEO says, it's do or die. And I believe we will be the doers. So please, please, if you have a heart and a passion to help others, please get back to me. It's amazing. Amazing, amazing. Well, I will sign off for today because I guess it's almost 19 minutes that I went on, but you know what? When you have a dream, you have a passion, you have the love for the Lord, and you know in your own heart, this is right. Nothing will stop you. Nothing is impossible. Even with oxygen, I can still sit here and do this. So I'm looking for people that will help me, help myself in the community to change, help to bless others. Whether that's governments, organization, family, friends, we have to start somewhere. 
Start with one person, one family, one village, one town, one city, one province, and one country at a time. And I'm here in Regina, Saskatchewan, so let's start here. I need your help. I'm not begging you to be a founder. I just need your help to help me bless others. But if you need the vision, call me. You have my phone number or my instant message me, whatever it takes. We need to connect to change people's lives. Okay. I like to end my videos with God bless, take care, prayers for each and every one around the globe, and praise be to God, because I know the changes are coming. Abundance overflow is coming. God bless. Love you all. Bye-bye for now.